Ramadan's finished, as promised, more videos. Today, we're cracking open some uh, Roast Collective gear. Um, these guys are, I think, based in Brisbane, and uh, they're starting to do a subscription service, so they've sent me out their first uh, batch. The Roast is Bellissimo Coffee, Nicaragua, El Salvador, Red Bourbon, and H1 and H3 hybrids. It's a natural and black honey process, so this is a blend. This is also an Omni Roast, um, so basically what that means is you can kind of make it any way, the way they roast it. Um, so it can be made as an espresso filter or plunger. So what I'm going to be doing today is actually a Delta. So I don't know if anyone's seen the Delta press yet. Um, I do believe these guys are based in Brisbane as well. They're grinding with the Commandante. Set to 35 clicks at the moment. Good way to check your Commandante is actually just start uh, swirling the uh, handle around. Oh, sweet. So we're ready to go. I've got my Delta upside down. The thing pressed all the way down to the bottom. So I'm gonna put in 21 grams on the top. The lid on the top, which has been pre-wet and has the filter in it already. And a really good point here with the Delta guys, make sure you take it off your scale because you will be pressing on it and you can damage your scales if you do it any other way. I'll put the timer this way so y'all can see. So we're gonna go to the 50 mil line and what I'm gonna do is press on once I start pressing. So I'll get to the 50 mil line first and I'm gonna start the timer and start to press. I'm gonna press over 10 seconds. 30 seconds, so 15 seconds. We're gonna set up now. Wait till all the water's drained. This one. I was to explain the taste of a Delta, it be in between an AeroPress and a V60. So it doesn't really necessarily have the same sort of clarity you would find in a V60, but also doesn't have that body and texture you can carry through on an AeroPress. So maybe it's really good for people who kind of are into that in between thing. Yeah, I haven't really fiddled with this too much, but I thought I would just do a little quick uh, video on uh, how to make one. But I'm gonna be doing lots of like random home brews like this for the next couple of weeks or so. 